you can get lost in art. You can um, express your feelings, express your emotions, and you can shut out a lot of the world through your art. There's a lot of bad things that uh, go on. When I was younger as a teenager, there wasn't a whole lot of bad things. I, left a, I led a very good life, but I still needed a place to hide away in my own little room. And uh, once I started painting, that was it. I was on my own, uh, in, in amongst my own thoughts and my own mind. In 1990, I was uh, diagnosed with cancer, uh, serious cancer, and the doctor gave me a 50-50 chance of survival if I have an operation. So I decided to have the operation, and uh, guess what? I survived. So in 1991, I created uh, an art studio in Fort Langley at the back of Gasoline Alley. Very, very tiny. Um, no bigger than 700 square feet. Well, I started off with two students, and uh, those two students are still my very good friends, and one student still takes lessons from me. I decided to go into the full-time teaching because I was successful at it. I guess people were learning. So more and more students came, more and more students came. Uh, I needed more and more space. So from Gasoline Alley, I went to uh, the Main Street in Fort Langley, and uh, <clears throat> that grew and grew, and eventually they tore down my building in Fort Langley, and so I needed to relocate. We had tried a couple of places before we found this location here where we're at now. Uh, we got 3,000 square feet here. We now have 166 registered students who attend classes every month, once a week. So it's been quite successful. Uh, we teach pretty well everything here all mediums to all ages and for whatever reason you have that you want to become an artist that's the main thing what do you want to do as an artist um, have you lost a mate have you lost a husband have you lost a wife have you been through tragedy have you been through whatever well through the art you can um, console yourself i guess and get through hard times what the future is of the studio, I don't know. Uh, I plan on retiring soon. And who is going to carry on the studio? I don't know yet. Uh, we will uh, see if we can find someone to carry on and go into the future for the next 30 years. And we'll see what happens then.